guys, are you ready? Are you ready? Hello! Hi guys! It could be the smallest thing, but she will put her full effort into anything. And she just cares, and I mean, you can see that when with her kids as well. Do you guys want to? You want to see my wedding dress? Let me turn it around. <laughs> Anytime I go visit her at school, I mean, her kids just love her to death. I will tell Drew that you said hi. She just, she's a very caring person, and I think she gets that from her mother for sure. All right, I'll send you guys pictures, okay? Yeah, I, th I think that would probably be my favorite thing. All right, love you, bye. From the moment I met her, I, I knew, like, it was a great match. She was so excited for me to meet him and just couldn't stop talking about how kind he is. Well, tell me about her. He's like, well, she is smart. She is funny. She is beautiful. He's the most selfless person I've ever met in my entire life. It completely made sense. It seemed easy. I know all of this is a dream come true for you. I'm so happy for you, and I love you both. Jennifer's dream growing up was always to have her grandfather perform her wedding. So after our minute where you can take pictures, he's going to come up and be able to perform the ceremony. It's a very special occasion that brings us together today. On behalf of Jennifer and Drew, I welcome you to witness their marriage vows, and to share their joy. Hey you, my sweet honey bunches of oats. We made it. I can't believe after all the talk and the heartache with long distance, we made it to our wedding day. I wanna start off by saying thank you. Thank you for being the man that you are not only today, but also through this whole journey to get to this day. Hi, honey. I know you're super nervous right now. I can hear your teeth chattering from here. So the first time Jennifer and I met was at uh, Dave & Buster's, and it was so loud in Dave & Buster's. We, I thought the date was going awful. It was the most awkward date ever because it was so loud and we didn't know each other, so how are you supposed to have fun like shooting basketballs? And from there, he asked if we want to go to the beach. So he drove me in his car. He walked me a mile down the road because that's where his friends were. And one of the things that I loved about that moment was as we were walking down this busy street, he pushed me to the side and said, you stand on this side of me so that if a car were to come, <laughs> He would get hit first and not me. And I said, I would never date anybody who didn't do that. Getting engaged was, was rather difficult. She catches on to little things. I could just like give her a wink and she's like, what are you, what are you planning? I'm like, no, oh, I'm just giving you a wink. Drew and I got engaged at Walmart. He and I would meet halfway at this Walmart because he lived in Jacksonville, I lived in New Smyrna. So we would meet and then we would take one car to wherever we were going. So that Walmart kind of held a special place for us even though we hate Walmart and we want Target because <laughs> Target is life. My mom brought her around and she about burst in tears. I didn't have to say anything. It was exactly how we wanted it. People make fun of us for it being in a Walmart parking lot, but it was going back to that the third date where we knew, we both knew it was, we were the one for each other. Are you Drew, I promise to be your best friend and your teammate through life. I promise that neither of us will wear the pants in our marriage. And as you so eloquently put it, instead we will share the pants and we will be so close in the same pant leg that our toes will touch. I promise to be the best co-pilot on our long drives and to continue to say I'm gonna stay up the whole time with you. 
and then fall asleep an hour in. <laughs> and I promise to always be goofy with you because with you, I'm truly myself. I love you so much. And I choose you today, tomorrow, and the rest of our lives. Now, Jennifer and Drew have given themselves to each other by solemn vows with the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings. I pronounce them husband and wife. Drew, you may kiss your bride. Woo! <laughs> I'm so excited for our day in life together. I hope we never stop inventing goofy, silly ways to tell each other how much we love each other. Let's never stop having movie moments. Something in me would not turn